Hey everybody, Tom Barnes. Stories from the 78, going down to the south side to Marionette Park, which is like this little tiny enclave, kind of in the, around the city, but it's the city, but it's not the city. Either way, 115 Bourbon Street is there, and it is like the bar on the south side of Chicago. I have my friend Pat here to talk about their big 25th anniversary. How you doing, man? Doing well. How about yourself? I'm doing great. I can't believe it's been 25 years of bourbon. It's unreal. And honestly, it's such an accolade that's um, very not, not very common uh, in the service industry, in the restaurant industry. So, again, we're just so grateful over here to even get to 25. Yeah, and you guys survive. I mean, the pandemic is a big one. Mm -hmm. But even outside of the pandemic, there's still, what, like 21 years of, like, surviving the bar business in Chicago or around Chicago, I should say. But the South Side's a little different. And where this is, 115th Street, uh, right, uh, right off of Western Avenue there. Uh, it used to be a handy Andy back in the day. <laughs> now it's <laughs> like, how many total uh, rooms is Bourbon Street? I think a lot of people don't know how big this place is. This place is massive. I mean, we have two major stages, mm -hmm. a huge beer garden, banquet rooms, and a nightclub. So a ton of great spaces to offer an array of events, everything from concerts, live live entertainment, DJs, and then those uh, family events like weddings, um, the luncheons, and those types of celebrations as well. Yeah, I mean, full disclosure, I had my wedding there in 2022, July. Actually, <laughs> you did. Oh my, yeah, it was just not that long ago, July 9th. Um, <laughs> and uh, but I I personally remember going to Bourbon Street when I was in college. Come home on Black Wednesday. <laughs> and you went to bourbon and everybody i went to illinois state they either it was illinois mm -hmm. state or u of i you talked to your friends and everybody went to bourbon when they got home because it was like a mini family reunion or high school reunion and as far as i know that still happens quite a bit yes there's very much that family reunion aspect every time you go in you know, you're going to see friends from that you grew up with on the south side you're going to see a lot of familiar faces uh, not to mention the legendary staff those familiar faces as well when you walk through those doors and we're just grateful to offer that platform for people to reunite, see each other again, reconnect and be uh, that staple on the South side for people. Yeah. And, and another full disclosure is uh, I worked at WG in a long time and I came to them years ago with the idea of doing a live broadcast on St. Patrick's day at uh, Bourbon street. And <laughs> that has been nothing but spectacular every year. Uh, Nick and Lori, the owners, have rolled out the red carpet for what we wanted to do. They still continue to do so to this day. Uh, and we came back after the pandemic. And, uh, you know, I just was one of my favorite things I've ever done in all. And I've been in television for 20 years. I absolutely love it. And I love what bourbon stands for. Like you go there and it is very much a family vibe. That's why we had our wedding there. And uh, the food is outstanding. I think it's so underrated how good the food is. I know the fried chicken's on the sly these days because you got to have, <laughs> but it's amazing. So if you ever get a chance to do the fried chicken at Bourbon Street, you got to do it. But talk about the big party you guys got going on on Sunday to celebrate the 25th. Yes. Yeah, so we're opening the doors to the public at 6 p.m. for a special ceremony where we're going to acknowledge Nick and Lori DeNovo, our owners. Plus, we'll have a couple of acknowledgments um, from a state rep as well as the mayor of Marionette Park coming in to initiate our celebration. And uh, right after those speeches and special moments, we're gonna kick off the Chris Weaver Band all the way from Nashville. And they'll be coming in and performing starting at six until about 8, 8.30. And the celebration will continue throughout the whole building um, until I guess till it ends, till the, the final moment. So. I love it. And you guys were doing a little something earlier. You know, we, we were supposed to talk the other day and things didn't work mm -hmm. out. And then today you've been busy doing things at Bourbon. Like what's the room you're in? What were you doing earlier today? So earlier today, we're just getting those social media posts together for the actual anniversary, which is actually on Friday, um, August 2nd. Mm -hmm. So um, we're celebrating, we're getting uh, content for that day, making sure we're wrapping up the 25 years in a way to just recognize the owners, Bourbon Street's legacy, the support from the community uh, in the way that we're thanking uh, the, the community on uh, social media. So just getting that together and then gearing up for Sunday, which is going to be an amazing celebration. It'll offer that reunion aspect as well, where you're going to connect with people who you haven't seen in a while. Everyone's coming from for, uh, former Bourbon Street staff to all the new people who are going to be finally meeting the people who began this uh, this business so yeah there's even a connection to the bachelorette right yes so kenny yeah 
hey, Kenny and Mario are, you know, are celebs. Um, they're gonna, they're, they won't be in attendance, but they do have something special prepared from them that we're going to um, debut during that ceremony portion at 6 p.m. Yeah, I got to say a uh, shout out to Kenny just because when I, we did start those early years at Bourbon Street mm-hmm. for St. Patrick's Day, and we did like a 25th anniversary for WGN, we celebrated down there. Kenny always got us the live music. So, which was awesome. I mean, it was before Kenny did anything with the Bachelorette and all that <laughs> stuff. Always good guy. But that kind of is a testament to everybody I've worked with over the years from Sam, uh, Bernadette was another person, mm-hmm. Mandy yes. and Scott and you. I mean, just my goodness. I know there's been a lot of people that have gone through there, but that place truly represents why I love being from the South side of Chicago and why I'm so proud and uh, uh, give me a little tour real quick, if you will, just because I, the room and explain what the room is behind you for folks who have never been. And we got to tell them that they need to go. OK, so this will be the room where we're going to have our big presentation and the Chris Weaver band will be performing. So right behind me is our sports bar. And you can see over here, massive space. Yeah, you can see that stage over to the right. And there's a ton of seating. This is going to be a sea of people come Sunday, all community people, uh, former staff. Everyone from the Bourbon Street family is going to be here in this space. And this is our, our one of our main rooms. But again, as you mentioned, this is a big, big Bourbon is a big space. We offer sure a lot is. more stages than that. But again, this is our main room. We call it the sports bar or the front stage area. We have a lot of entertainment there throughout the year. What's the best way people can find out information for the big 25th anniversary? Awesome. So if you want to visit our website at 115bourbonstreet.com, right on our homepage will be the full information as to when to arrive and what to expect at 6 p.m. on Sunday as we celebrate our 25th. Oh, man. Thanks so much for talking to me, Pat. I appreciate it very much. Um, And congratulations on the 25th. We haven't had a chance to work together, so it's funny that we're doing it in this capacity. It's just kind of what Bourbon Street is all about, and I love that I got to be able to talk to you about this. And congratulations. Please pass it on to Nick and Lori uh, just because they – I mean, it was a little bar way back when. Maybe not so little, but smaller than it is now, and now it's just this massive space that – I've seen concerts there, wrestling. I mean, they've had MMA fights there. They have everything that happens at Bourbon. They do. It offers something for everyone, and that's a value that we've definitely relished throughout the, our 25 years, and just to offer something for all types of people, all walks of life. Amazing. Happy 25th to Bourbon Street. Thank you so much, Tom, and thank you for having us. Absolutely.